All right, guys, welcome back. Um, all right, so today I'm gonna kill two birds with one stone. I wanted to do a lipstick try on video because I got this huge PR package from Smashbox with all these lipsticks. And I haven't done a lipstick try on video in a while. Also, I wanted to talk to you guys about this product. Here it is. All right, <laughs> I'm sure you guys have seen lip plumping, plumping, lip plumping products on the market. You know, those little sucky ones and then like lip glosses and whatnot. So this one really intrigues me. So I got this little puppy and I wanna talk to you guys about it and it's called the PMD Kiss Plumping System and it comes with a lip plumping lip gloss and this little magical machine. Now, <laughs> I've been trying this out for about a month now and I was really super skeptical at first because I don't, I don't, I never did put any um, credence into machines that make your lips plumper. So I figured, listen, if I'm gonna try a bunch of lipsticks today, why not like make my lips look like hella big, you know what I mean? All right, so how this works is you put the lip serum on your lips and then you put this on each quadrant of your lips at a time um, for a certain amount of pulses. So what you do is put the serum on. Let's put some of the serum on. Okay, so I put the serum on, and now what you're gonna do is take this little kissy kiss machine, and you're gonna put it on each quadrant of your lips for 10 pulses. I find that more like 15 pulses works better for me, and what you wanna do is put it like kind of on the inside of the lip, not like on the outside, because you don't wanna cause bruising or anything like that, so you put it on each quadrant of the lips for 10 pulses, it says, but like I said, I'm gonna do 15, and you guys will see the difference, watch. Ready? Here's my lips before. <laughs> it feels so funny. I like just sucking your lips. <laughs> the upper lip now. It's like giving your lips like little hickeys. Here's my lips after. What do you think? So you can see like my lips are a little red. Well, now that they're plump, let's get onto the lipstick. All right. If you guys are interested in trying out this lip plumping device, I'm gonna put all the links and information in my description bar for you guys. Thank you to PMD for sponsoring this video so I can share all these great lipsticks and this lip plumping device with my viewers. So it does help a girl out. Okay, so let's get on to the lipstick trying because this is so much fun. All right, I have a lot of lipsticks to try out. Um, I mean, guys, look at how many. Ooh. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to unbox all of these, line them up so I don't keep you guys waiting like eight million thousand years for each one. And then there's regular, which is kind of like a satin glossy kind of finish. So let's just let's just hit it. All right, this first shade is called um, Do Not Wrong. No, Do No Wrong. <laughs> do No Wrong, and it is a matte shade. Oh, it looks like a nice nude. Oh, I already like this color. I'm not gonna do any swatches on my lips. I mean, on my arms. I'm just gonna do them right on my lips. So, let's let's see what we got here. It's actually really nice and comfortable. I like the color. I haven't worn a shade like this in a long time. I actually really like it. They're matte. It, it, this is a matte shade, so this actually feels like really comfortable and creamy. Like, it doesn't feel like stark matte, you know? What do you guys think? Okay, so this is the first shade, and this is in the, what did I say this was? Do no wrong. Hmm. Be legendary lipstick. This next shade is called uh, Cliffhanger, and this is also a matte. Ooh, this looks like a nice nude. Let's try this on. Okay. Uh oh. What do you guys think? <gasps> oh my gosh, this shade is so pretty. Mm. I'm going to put this one to the side so I it doesn't get lost in the, in the shuffle. What is this called? Cliffhanger. This is really beautiful. I love how it's like it's just like a warm, rosy brown. Really super nice. Well, wow. yeah, and the comfortable. Comfortable, totally comfortable. One thing good about not wearing foundation anymore, I don't have to worry about wiping off lipstick, like wiping off my foundation. <laughs> okay, so this next shade is called Top Shelf, and it is not a matte, it's the regular formula. Ooh, another pretty shade, okay. Oh, look how creamy it is. Okay, that's Top Shelf, that's really pretty. Oh yeah, I love the sheen. It's a really pretty sheen. Oh, hello. I'm glad I wore makeup and a, a shirt the way I did for these first three colors. <laughs> really pretty. What do you guys think? 
Okay, so this next lipstick is called Bankrolled, and it's a regular formula. <gasps> it's black. <sighs> this will be the last, last one I try on. I am not putting black on in the beginning of this video. <laughs> Let's go to another one. This one is called uh, Punch Drunk. Punch Drunk. All right. All right, there's a pink. We could do a pink. Black lipstick. Smashbox. I can't do that right now. Okay. Woo. Look at this. Pigmentation on this color is like, wow! So pretty! Oh my goodness! Punch drunk. It's like punchy. <laughs> I really love this. Okay, so the next one we're gonna try is called Straight Up. Okay, Straight Up looks like a brown. Um, it looks like a real 90s color. So, Paul Abdul, yes. <laughs> oh wait, was this a matte? No, this is a regular formula. Okay, so it's a brown nude. Okay, so this is straight up. Really pretty. I don't know that this is a color I get a lot of use out of because I don't use a lot of brownie kind of colors like this. Um, I think it's pretty. I think it's pretty. I just don't know where I would go with it, like this raisiny color, you know? Hmm. But it is nice. I like it. It's pretty. Okay, let's move on. Okay, this next color. I'm just picking from a pile, guys. Just picking from a pile. Ooh, this color is called Spectacle. It's a bright coral. So let's try and spectacle. This is gonna clash with my makeup. This reminds me of Flamingo by MAC. Or like a more sheer version of Impassioned. I do admit it like it doesn't look bad on my skin tone, but I'm not crazy about the shade. I used to be really into shades like this, but not really so much anymore. So that's it. That's spectacle. Alright, this next shade is bombastic. That's not how you spell boombastic, is it? Boombastic? A lot of these are 90s. This is a bright pink, and this is a, is this a matte shade? No, this is not a matte shade. All right, I know I'm gonna hate this color on me, guys. I know it's gonna make my teeth look so yellow. Ugh. I'm gonna try it on, I'm doing it for you guys. The combination of the Kiss uh, PMD Limp Plumper, and then all this wiping off of lipstick. My lips are huffy. Okay, it's a pretty shade if you have like, a tan and bright white teeth. Like, to be fair, it doesn't make my teeth look super yellow, but yellower than I would like. Um, this is a very sheer shade. It would probably actually be really nice with like a fuchsia lip liner. Okay, well, this is, uh, what was this called? Boombastic. All right, this next shade is called Honey. Honey, honey, honey. Ooh. <laughs> oh, I love this shade. I could tell already. Uh, hell yeah. Oh, uh, this lip formula is so glossy, but like not sticky, and it's so pretty, guys. Oh, this shit is so nice. Honey is is a good one. I like honey. Okay, next. All right, so this next shade is called Headliner. I'm a little worried about Headliner. Oh, that's pretty. That's like a bright, another bright coral, but this one looks like more like not as shiny as the other one. I don't know. The shade is slightly different than the other one. I can't find it because it's in a pile. But this one is, I like, I don't know. It's just like more toned down. I really like it. Mmm, this is a pretty color. I like this a lot. I like the packaging on these lipsticks too. They just look very luxe. I like the, like the steel um, inside of the bullet. Really pretty. And the top doesn't just slip off. Like, it's kind of like forces on a little bit. That way you don't have to worry about your lipstick top flying off in your, in your, um, bag. So, alright. This is that color. What was this called? Headliner. Alright, this next color is a matte. It's called Power On. Let's see what Power On looks like. A lot of these colors are very bright. I wasn't expecting that. Because you really can't tell from the boxes. So this kind of looks like this lipstick. This kind of looks like Headliner, but like a matte formula. A lot of these are like summertime shades to me. Oh, that's a great application. Power On. It's pretty. like that. Okay, so let's move on. Alright, this next shade is called Booked. Ooh, that's a pretty shade. That's like a grayish. Alright, let's put this on. I'm excited. Like a purpley, purpley gray beige. I like the shade. Um, I really thought this was going to make my teeth look super yellow. It doesn't seem to be too bad. This color is nice. I like it. It's super opaque too. This is a great color. I think this one might be my favorite. I'm gonna set this aside. I think this might be my favorite of them. Yeah. All right, next shade is called Latte, and it's a matte shade. Uh-oh. Colors like this. 
Ooh, this one's gonna look terrible on me. I'm gonna try it on, because I love you guys. But this is gonna look bad. Okay, this is one of those shades that you have to be wearing like full, full foundation on for it to look good. Ugh. This looks terrible on me. It's a pretty shade. It just looks bad on me though. Mm. And it looks bad with my eye makeup and this and my hair. It just, this, this looks like it's like. Oh. All right, next shade is called Fair Play. What in God's name? First of all, why is this lipstick like destroyed? But it looked like it hit the top and this is lavender. Holy. <laughs> it's rocking. This lipstick is to- Oh, it's totes broken! I knew it was broken, I could tell. <laughs> this is awful! Why would they even sell a lipstick that looks like this? Oh. Oh, yeah. I look sexy! Woo! Alright, so this lipstick is probably going in the garbage because I couldn't even re-gift this lipstick. It's broken and it looks like death. So, if you guys see Fair Play, stay away from Fair Play. Okay, people, I am really banking on the fact that no shades are going to be that bad again. Um, this next color is called Skinny Jeans. Oh my god! <laughs> As I just trash talked the other lipstick, this one pops up next. I swear to god that wasn't planned. I swear to god. Um, this one looks like a dusty blue. Alright, let's try it on, guys. Maybe I should just go try on the black one next. Uh, well, at least it's sheer. Holy. I don't understand the purpose of making these lipsticks. Alright, seriously, I look like I'm cold. Ready? You guys are impressed with my acting skills. I know it. I know it. Oh yeah, this shade. What is this called? Skinny jeans. I should have known better. I mean, it's called skinny jeans. Of course it's gonna be blue. Since we're already trying on all these horrendous colors, let's go for the black one. This one is bankrolled. Um, I wear black lipstick. Black lipstick maybe once a year. So, I guess this is the time. Oh no, it's sheer! Ah! Oh, sheer black lipstick. What the heck? If I'm gonna wear black lipstick, this better be like hella black. Like, black my blood, my soul. <laughs> Nothing like a sheer wash of black lipstick. This color is just awful. Oh my goodness, this is awful. This shade. Alright. I'm gonna put this one to the side too. This is just, this is just bad. I'm actually relieved that that black wasn't so deep because I don't have problems removing it. Okay, so this next shade is called Warrior Pose. I'm thinking this is gonna be a red. Or not. <laughs> this looks like a dark, dark, like gray brown. All right, let's check it out. Let's check this out. Nothing can be as bad as the last few lipsticks we tried on. The last three are terrible. Okay, with the right lip liner, this lipstick is beautiful. It makes your teeth, it doesn't like make your teeth look yellow, which is always a struggle for me. This shade is really nice. I love this shade, oh my goodness. I didn't expect to like it so much. But it is really, really pretty. Okay, what is this called again? This is called Warrior Pose. Warrior Pose like, Whoa! Is that, is that a Warrior Pose? Or like this, right? Right, Wonder Woman? Okay, <laughs> let's move on. Okay, we only have five more to go, guys. This next one is called Fair Play. Okay, we only have four more to go, guys. Uh, this one is called Totes. Totes, and Totes is a match it. Oh, it's pink. It looks like Barbie pink. And it matches my shirt. <laughs> All right, this is really pretty. This is a great summertime color. I don't know that I'd really get a lot of use out of this this time of year, um, but this is pretty. I like this. What do you guys think? It's pink. You know, it's pink. This is great with a nude eye, lots of lashes, and ink lips. Okay, let's move on. Let's see, this next one is called Action. Oh no, no. There's another purple lipstick in this range. Oh my gosh. Well, this one's really pigmented. Holy mackerel. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, hello. Flashlight teeth. Um, okay. On the right person, this color would actually be really pretty. It's super pigmented and the formula is super comfortable and it's even and not patchy. That's the only thing that I can say about this shade. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, two left. All right, this one is called Black Cherry. 
Thank God, thank God, this is a normal color. Okay. Shade's really pretty. Gonna look great with a lip liner. Gonna look super great with a lip liner. Okay, Black Cherry. We're, ha we're ending on a high note. Hopefully this very last lipstick is a good shade. Because if it's not, I'm gonna be upset. Okay, let's go for broke. And the final shade is called Off Script. It's a matte. What do you guys think it is? We haven't gotten one red lipstick yet. This looks like a good one. Okay, this looks like a nude. It's a little on the brown side. Let's check it out. And it actually matches what I'm wearing, kind of. Not really, kind of a little. This shade's actually really nice. I like it. It doesn't exactly match what I'm wearing right now, but it is nice and pretty. Um, I think it's, you know, it's a good formula. Uh, okay, I'm gonna go put on my favorite color right now. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna go put on my favorite. Can you guys guess? Okay, both was my favorite. Okay, yeah, this one was my favorite shade. I really liked it. I think I'm gonna get a lot of use out of this. Um, I think overall the formula of these lipsticks, well after trying on 20, I'm like screaming, but um, I think that overall the formula on these lipsticks are really good. I think the glossy ones um, are a little bit more sheer. Some of them are a little bit streaky, um, but the matte formula is really pigmented and soft. It's almost like a satin, not a matte. It's more satin to me. Um, I love it. I think this is great. There was only a few that I really didn't appreciate and I like. I didn't like the funky ones, the two purple colors, the blue and the blue. Look, ah, lipsticks weren't my favorite, but I do like this. So um, that's all I got for you guys. I hope you enjoyed this uh, try on video. If you want to learn more about PMD, I will put a link to it down in the description bar if you want to check out the product. <laughs> okay, guys, if you enjoyed this video, give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye, guys.